cases yeah. in supermarkets. We would install those long freezer yeah. cases and all the lights. That's what, right. we, that's what we would do every summer. Yeah. So this, uh, this one year, my father had his shop, and he decided for whatever reason that he wanted a new wall on the front of his shop. So he tore <laughs> down probably about uh, you know, 16 feet high and probably about uh, 30 feet long. He just completely tore yeah. the wall down, and my brother and I had to dig a six-foot hole. <laughs> We for would the mix foundation. It, for yeah, the foundation. Right. We would mix in the concrete by hand. Yeah. A year and a half. We were building this wall for a year and a half. Every day after school, we would come and mix in concrete, put it in the hole, doing it. Yeah. And it was just myself and my little brother. And I remember standing back, looking at that wall, saying, there's going to be a hole here forever. <laughs> there will never be anything <laughs> never but a hole exist. here. That's right. And a year and a half I don't later, have that many days. I know, <laughs> a year and a half later, we laid the the final brick. Yeah. And my father stood back with my brother and I and I know he planned this. He says he he says he didn't, but I know he had been planning this yeah. and writing this <laughs> for his <laughs> for for the past 2 years. But he we stood back, we looked at the wall and he looked at me and my brother and he said, did. "Now don't y'all never tell me that you can't do, do something. something and walked into the shop. That's great. Like, now here's what's interesting. You said what? You said it. <laughs> I, I, I said, that man's crazy. <laughs> Something wrong with him, Harry. We need to get out of here. <laughs> what is he doing to my man, head? Is he, did he start drinking? Is he drinking? <laughs> but he, what's great about that story and what's great about your dad is that you seem to have come from mm -hmm. a happy family. Absolutely. Yeah. Well, fairly. Reasonably. Yeah. <laughs> Reasonably. Yeah, yeah. He's a little crazy. <laughs> yeah, yeah. This thing about walls. Uh, yeah, he's a little, he's a little, yeah. no, it was, But uh, generally, there was generally, no great, yeah. you didn't have the kind of conflict mm -hmm. that my Ali had. Oh, definitely not you know, like Ali that kind of, And yet you have the amazing amount of drive. I mean, mm -hmm. you, there's a sense of mission with you, sense mm -hmm. of, of commitment, sense of prepared to Absolutely. do what it requires. Mm -hmm. Right? Absolutely. I mean, so you, you, to, you didn't come from a struggling artist background to become. Well, you know what? I an think, accomplished professional. I think both both of my parents and and my grandparents were achievers. You yeah. know, uh, right. my mother worked for the school board right. of, of Philadelphia. So, growing up, we couldn't say y'all. You know, yeah. it's like we if we you would run my out. My kids do not say y'all. Yeah, right. You know, <laughs> we would run out of the house. And scream to our friends, yo, what y'all about to do? My mother's, up. Oh, that's it. <laughs> Back in this house. Back in this house. And we'd be sitting upstairs crying. And my grandmother would come in and say, baby, you know a y'all is a boat. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Like, oh, but there's you know, a difference. So, there's, yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. So, you know, there were, there were very specific rules. And there was uh, a, a constant desire to be better. Yeah. You know, we, 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 did, we didn't grow up. Uh, with the sense that where we were was where we were going to be. You know, we grew up with the sense that where we were almost didn't matter because we it, were becoming, it, we were becoming right. something greater. Yeah. And, and I, I always remember um, that my mother or, or father or grandmother would say, that's great, baby. You did a really good job with that. That's incredible. Congratulations. Try this next time. Yeah. You know, it was always a, there was always a little bit Stretching. more. Stretching. Absolutely. Yeah. The, when you started out as a rapper, mm -hmm. did you, were you already thinking, if I get to do this really well, I can do, I'll have a television show. And if no. I have a television show, <laughs> I can be in feature films. Mm -hmm. And if I'm in feature films, I can no, be. It was, for me, it was always, I, my biggest dream coming up was I wanted uh, to hear one of my records on the radio. That was it? That was it. That's what I wanted to do. I wanted to hear one of my records on the radio. And I wanted to see someone hear my record on the radio. And in June 1986, I saw a guy ride past my father's shop, you know, <laughs> dropping his head, you know. So from, you know, from that point, I've really been beyond, uh, beyond my dreams. And even with, with the... Uh, the first Grammy nomination, we were, we were beyond yeah. anything. We we when we recorded, we didn't say, "Wow, it would be cool to be." <laughs> we at just the want to hear it on the radio. We just want to hear it on the radio, you know. Yeah. And uh, from from that point, I've I've been.